So in part, in my last video, as you remember, I mentioned that the dice cube, 6 and 1, is the only 7. Therefore, what I would end up with is 1 and 6 would be, if I flip it both ways, they would be mirroring in on the 7. 6 on one side, 1 on the other side. If the dice was see-through, we would see 7. If any other side was see-through, all we'd see is 5. So we'd have 5 and 5, 10, 5 and 5, 10. Plus or minus would give me 0, 0, 0, obviously. This would give me 10, 10, and 14. 14, 24, 34. Or if the 7 was, remember, up and down, right? This is up, everything is down, we'd have 20 around. We'd have 20 around. Do I have that sign here, 20 around? Okay, I'd have 20 around. And then 14 in the center, up and down, 7 and 7. Or if you want to look at it, I'd have four sides at the 5 total. And up and down with total 14. 1 plus 4 will equal to that 5. So we have 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5. And if we multiply 5 times 5 by 5, it equals to 125. If you want to go uh, 5, 1, 2 memory, or if you want to look at it as if we take this and we split it in half, we get half and half. Two sides with one split. Five, one, two. Remember, everything in matrix has to make sense or it won't move on. Right? If the computer doesn't understand it, it can't make the next level. At the same time, um, what I want to mention, okay, or uh, defer. Let's not defer. Let's continue with the same thing. Um, 2 times 5, 2 plus 5, and this is the earth number, will equal 10, right? And 7 will equal to 17. 5, 10, 17. 5, 10, 17, and 17 is 34. This will create, okay, uh, okay, let's not, let's not go into that. We have 10 and 24 is 34, or 17 and 3. What is this? The reverses. Okay, let's let's mark the reverse 24 and 3, 10 and 17, reverse 27, 27 alphabet. The total would equal to 54. 24x, 10x Roman numerals, DC world. 20, okay, is a one part. It's, I can't explain it. It's 5555 five, five, five equals to that 20. Or in French, right, is one part. They mention it as 80. 80 is your communication. It's the divider between... Uh, the spirit of 76, it's hard to exactly explain it and what happens when a circle, the eye of the circle. Um, there was one other piece in here. Um, if I minus this, it would be 14. That would be DNA. Uh, if I minus this from this, it'll be 14. And that's your DNA. 14th letter is N. First letter is A. Fourth letter is D. The 14th letter or the tenth letter and four is jd let's call it jack daniels if you want um there was one other piece in here that seems to be missing yes i didn't mention i didn't mention this before okay and i'm going to mention it now is that if you had three judges and they can judge and each judge judged you one less than perfect right you would have a total of 27 out of 30. if you would have a perfect out of that, you'd have 28 out of 30. If you had two perfects out of that, you'd have 29 out of 30. And obviously, we're not from the other world, right? We can't be perfect in this world. It's a connection between one and the spirit. 19, sorry, this would be 19. Uh, this would be 20, 20. How can I explain this? I, I don't know how to explain it. Anyways, three judges come up. Each one gives you nine. If one judge gave you 10, you'd get 28. If another judge gave you 10, it would be 29. So you have to have a one perfect world, right? Imagine we have the 10 card, right? We have one perfect world connecting the birth, right, in two worlds. Nine and nine. So you'd have two nine cards and a ten cards. It's the same thing as when you play blackjack. Only one card will count for ace 11, right? Ace 11. So that the ace equals to 11. So now let's get into something a little bit. Um, let's move on to something else. 
I just want to talk about 1 and 2. Um, the first one is 1, 1 plus 0, 1 plus 9 is 10, becomes 1, 2 plus 8 is 10. This will be 47 equals to the cycle. This is the high side. In roulette, there's two sides. So we're switching conversations now. In roulette, there's two sides. On the bottom side of 1, we'll total 11, 1 and 10. On the top side, where the roulette board goes 1 to 18, and then 19 to 28, starting both with 1, and both starting with here, it's actually it's 10, and then gets reduced to 1. Here we have 47, right? 4 by 7, 28 equals to that cycle. 4 plus 7 equals to that 11. 9 and 4 equals to that 13. 9 by 4 is 36. It seems like it's a it's a ratio that balances two things between just like you do inches and meters or inches and and centimeters to the same thing as feet and um, the metric system and the imperial system if you want to look. So this one will be 49 and the gateway to the moon. This is your birth and here is your alternate current or your AI. Here is your 7 times 7, which is also represents in Christ and the moon. Um, the other thing I didn't mention uh, in my last video is that if you want to talk about zero or double zero, we have Mercury, which gives you a zero, and Venus that gives you a zero. Why? Because these two planets have no moons, apparently. Earth has one moon. Mars has two moons. So if you see two, one, zero, okay, and all zeros equal to six, I like to look at it that way. I now have to include the moons of the sixth planet, which is Saturn. Or if we're going reverse, it'll be Mars. The second planet is Neptune. The first planet is Pluto. The sixth planet is Mars. You can also go the reverse of Mercury is the first planet. Uh, Pluto is the second planet and um, Saturn as a third planet. How many moons are on Saturn? You know what I'm saying? If I have one zero and it's over here, are we talking about the one position, the 10 position, or the one position? Let's not use it as the hundreds. We could use it as the hundreds, right? Um, there's many, many, many things to, and this is all because of how we can create cycles. Um, another thing I wanted to mention is 6 and 15. And what is that? 6 and 15. 2 and 4 is 6. 3 and 3 is 6. 6 and 15. 21 represents cube. 24, 33. This is the mass. This is the cat representing GE, energy, and the moon. The total is 78, creating G and H, the gateway. This one over here, 5555 five, 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 BC, BC, AD. And 5, this is the total of the low 5. I can count it high also. 55 and 14 is 69. 57, 67, 72, the red sun. 63, 73, 80, communication. 34, 25 is 59, 69, 75, communication, running the gateway through the moon. Forget about the 7 because these all are 7s. 7, 7, 7, seven. forget about the 7. 7, seven eight, 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 eight. Right? G and H, your gateway heaven. Creation of E and I. Electric birth. Uh, I'm not even sure which way to do it. Here is the earth and here is the church to do it in this way. And rest in peace. CB codes 107, which this is what this creates, says rest in peace. One is the low, seven is the high, because that's what happens on the dice. One is the low, six and one creates seven as the high. Um, and that's another thing I wanted to mention, and it's not in here. Um, just give me a second to find it, where I wrote it down. There's so many little things that I wrote down, and it's here. 1 equals to 7, because the 1 is in 6 equaling to 7. 0 equals to 6, and I presume it's because of this over here. All zeros equal 6 mean it's the center of everything. So when you're talking binary, 0, 1, I'm trying to understand what does it mean. Does it mean that there's 1 missing over here, right? But you see it on this side over here. And since 1 equals to 6, I get a little confused and I'm not sure which level to take it. The word queen equals to 62. The word king equals to 41. Um, the rook equals to 59. Um, 12 moons, 300 
and 36, 12 moons, 28 days, 336. Pluto is three moons. How many moons does Pluto have? But three times the 28 cycle equals to 84 Pluto. Um, if we were talking about, um, there's many other things I was trying to look at. This, I took off somebody else's work. Um, in Baccarat, we stand on seven. We stand on most cases in Baccarat on six, seven, eight, nine, and five and under, we're pulling cards. Um, another thing I wanted to talk about is this. When we take that design over here, right? If I add this onto it, I create a four, okay? If I um, take this design and um, I do this to it, I create a six. If um, I do this to it, I create a nine. But if I just take the five, right, and I add this to it, I create the same six and nine and eight. Here's my eight, here's my six, here's my nine, and it's all been created through my five. And it can't be just these two. I need to use two of them because there's no area space to find center unless I put an X, and then I'll only be able to find a partial center in this. Um, is there anything else in here that I want to speak about? This is about darts and how numbers and darts. And you remember we see this, right? We've seen this before on the hieroglyphics or with Pharaoh or something, and how the 20 will come to create these numbers. And the reverse of the 20 in darts is down by number three. But I don't want to talk about this. Raphael 7286 and a constellation of Pegasus. Thank you for watching this video.